I'm going to talk about vaccine inequity or vaccine inequality. So I live abroad in another country that's in the global south. And I know almost no one who has gotten their vaccine. And when I look on social media, on Instagram, I see almost everyone I know my same age and maybe even younger in their early 20s posting pictures of their vaccines, uh, posting pictures of the card. First of all, I don't think you should post a picture of that card because it has some sensitive information about yourself. Um, so maybe blot out some of the information if you have posted it. But yeah, I think... I mean, it's awesome that people are sharing on social media that they got vaccinated because it does encourage other people to go out and get vaccinated. So there are some pros to it, but it also makes me think about how people who are at risk populations around the world do not have access to the vaccines because I'm seeing it right now. And that basically there's a large wait for a lot of people to get the vaccine. It makes me question kind of the inequalities around vaccinations and around uh, the COVID-19 pandemic. Obviously, we can think of a lot of institutional and local and national level uh, disparities in COVID-19, such as between black and white populations and so on and different income and economic factors. But let's not forget to think about it on an international level as well, because even though a lot of Americans have access to the vaccine, a lot of people globally don't have access to it, including frontline workers who are even the people in the hospital and the nurses and teachers and just all kinds of people that have to interact with a lot of people on a daily basis and that their wait time for the vaccine is going to be a, a very long time. So just something to think about in terms of... Uh, our progress here with COVID-19 and the vaccine. In addition, just the access to different types of vaccines and what is available in certain countries. So it makes me also think about what populations have access to and so on. So yeah, there's a lot to think about. I'm sure some of you have already thought about it, but just wanted to make this video in case anybody was thinking about it. So yeah. There's a big problem with vaccine inequality. I know that I thought of this when I saw that girl, Greta Thorn Thornburg, talk about it as well. So I like that she was thinking of it. If anybody else was thinking about it, please comment below. Thank you so much.